I mean, you know, a big part of why I wanted to come out here is because I do want to take a more public kind of track as a LGBTQ advocate. And on the road to being more public, I want to do a public announcement about my sexuality. Mm -hmm. I've never really stood up and said, I'm gay. Obviously, with us being together, anything that I do is going to impact you with people saying, wait a minute, if right. Greg is this LGBTQ advocate, like, who's he dating? So you're saying, like, they're going to want to know the T, regardless? Correct. <laughs> so for me, I never really came out. But about three years ago, let down my guard, called my dad, and I told him, I said, I've been dating this guy named Greg for the last three years. He took a deep breath. And he said, well, son, you know, I love you, but I am going to take my time to learn and understand it so that we can be closer together. And I appreciated that. And my friends echoed the same thing, where they were like, man, you can always come to us. With you doing this advocacy, it's something that I'll have to think about just in the senses of, am I ready to step towards being in the light with you? It's still uncomfortable in certain atmospheres to be like, oh, yeah, this is completely me. I worry about Elliot not even being on board yet with us coming out publicly. And, you know, is this going to be something that risks our entire relationship? I do want you to think about it. I just need more time to think about how that together is, if mm -hmm. it's like public or it's, you know, kind of behind the scenes. Okay.